Hello, Internet. This time I have some decent material because I actually went out into the world and uh, saw stuff. And that made me think about how funny life can be sometimes, which is the whole point of this show. Well, actually, the point of this show is just to me say stuff and you go, ha ha. But in any case, first thing is I wish to apologize to the residents of Nanaimo, the bathtub racing capital of the world. Apparently, they do not race bathtubs downhill, they race them as, as a kind of boat. Um, which makes no sense, because bathtubs sink in water. I know this for a fact, because every time I'm in a bathtub, it's underwater, rather than on top of it. But I'm dish. Um, okay, enough of the silliness. Mmm, oh. margarita sours. Yummy. Um, I went to the restaurant today, and surprisingly, the drip-free ketchup bottle, with a little seal in it, and it decided so that, well, my flow valve, doesn't work, because there's ketchup on the outside. What are the, what's it going to take? Like a, a ketchup static membrane? Nah. They have to clean the ketchup balls every night or something. It's just, it's a losing battle. I don't, I don't know what they're going to do. And finally, I bought a church key today. It's now on my keychain. Let me show you. I can't show you it because it's, my keychain's downstairs. Alright. Anyway. The church key was cool and all that. But, it actually came with instructions on the back of it. See? Right. They read thusly in case my focus wasn't good. Place opener on a bottle cap with lip opener under the bottle cap edge. While holding the bottle firmly with the other hand, lift upward on handle of opener until cap comes off. Now, tell, correct me if I'm wrong, but if you can't figure out how to use a church key intuitively just by, you know, holding it and having a bottle of beer, then you have no business drinking. Right. Um, now that the elitism is out of the way, how about a random article? Um, because I didn't do one yesterday. It has to do with not having used, uh, not having a computer, no, not having an internet where I was cooking. Because my laptop wasn't co connected to the internet. Yes, I know I have wireless, but, you know, still. Uh, the password is like nine digit long, and it, it, there's no mnemonic for it that will work. Nem mnemonic? Why did the Greeks do that? M and N don't fit. Alright, anyway, the random article today. Ooh, it's actually not a stub. Okay, Catholic ecumenical councils include 21 councils over a period of 1700 years. While definitions change throughout history, in today's understanding, ecumenical councils are assemblies of patriarchs, cardinals, residing bishops, abbots, male heads of religious orders, and other primates and jur juridical persons. Nominated by the Roman Pontiff, a.k.a. the Pope. Um, they meet and discuss matters of faith and the church discipline. Council decisions to be valid or approved by the Popes. Both of them? Apparently there are numbers of Popes. There's one in Kansas right now, which is bizarre. Um, I don't know. I, I don't have a problem with individual Catholics on a one-on-one -on -one basis, but I think Catholicism is a bit silly, especially with the worshipping Mary and Saints part, because they're not actually God or anything. Um, yeah. So, uh, this is not so much a request, this is not so much a word of wisdom, it's just a request. Don't step on the moment, Good day.